picture or not, because I won't know. <coughs> Well, now. Am I? Am I smiling properly? It's hard to smile when you're on your own. Hi guys and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to um, dismantle some taps off a couple of sinks that I picked up yesterday whilst uh, out carpet cleaning and just see what I get in weight off of them. And with that, let's get stuck in. Grips. That's all I need, I think. Nice bit of copper on this lot and brass. These are, these are the old taps, um, and the older the tap, the heavier they are. Proven to be a bit more difficult. I'll come back to that in a second. are well and truly stuck on from leaking over the time. They don't want to come off easily. They're all corroded around um, the uh, plastic with lime scale that, that's just corroded them. No, that's free. Normally what I would do, if I found these in a skip, I would just take a hammer to them, put a sheet over and break out the taps um, and leave the, and leave the uh, basin in the skip. But that wasn't an option for me because they weren't in a skip. I think brass at the moment is about four pounds eighty a kilo. So easy this one. No. 
might have to just break this one out. Let me go and get my hammer and uh, I will come back in just one second. So I've got my hammer and a cloth and goggles, but I want to try something else before I do that. have to break that there put on the safety goggles I'll just cover that there there we go that's got it this one off again if I don't get it off I have to just break it off doesn't like my old grip. I don't like the grips, I'm using grips because you, you can never get a really great grip on them. No. So same again, I'll just cover it. I'm just bash it through. pieces inside and then I'll break up this I'm gonna break up the porcelain and then just put it in the dry in the drive. I've got plenty of potholes in my drive so that'll fill in the potholes. Then the other one that we've got mm. let's see if we can get to this one. Plumber's probably got the right box socket to put on this to tighten it up when he does it. But you should always wear your safety glasses. One. 
So there you have it, a bit of plastic to go in the bin, the rest of it will go in the drive, and let's see what we got. It's on grams. Eleven hundred grams. Thousand grams. Twenty one hundred. So two two point seven kilos of brass. I'll just put this on and say it's brass. So 2.7, 2.7. So that's three kilos. That's 12 pounds worth of brass, which took, I mean, would have took less if I'd have been in the field, but um, bringing it back here took a little bit longer, maybe five minutes or so. But there, so you've got three kilos, 450 a kilo, you know, it's like 13 pounds and change. So for a few minutes work, 13 pounds is not too bad. Well, I'll shove this in my uh, brass bin because I have a few taps that I collected over the last week, uh, which are a few down, there's a, there's a few down here. Yeah, so these are the taps I picked up during the week. It's probably around, probably around 15 kilos there. Um, so not bad 15 kilo over the week you know I just add them together what I've got a big pile and then I'll run them down to the scrapyard well guys thanks for watching if you like the video please subscribe to the channel and uh, hit the uh, like button and if you want to see the next videos coming up hit the bell and that will notify you when the next videos come up and I'll see you in the next video thanks a lot bye for now